So I was just listening to the radio, right? And Justin Bieber's song, Peaches, which should be nominated for 18 Grammys, came on. It was a remix. It had Usher on it. It had Ludacris on it. And it had Snoop Dogg on it. And it just made me think, Snoop Dogg was rapping when Justin Bieber's parents were probably in diapers as well. Snoop Dogg has had the longevity of a person that drunk the fountain of youth. Snoop Dogg is the living... He is older than the pyramid. Snoop Dogg is a legend in every sense of the word. I guarantee you, Snoop Dogg was in the Bible next to Jesus eating bread and drinking gin wine. Snoop Dogg has walked with the aliens. Snoop Dogg has talked with the angels when the Lord was building mankind. He looked over and said, hey, Snoop, what you want California to look like? You already know, Long Beach, California first. Snoop Dogg has been crip walking before the color blue was invented. Snoop Dogg need his flowers. Not only do Snoop Dogg need flowers because he ain't gonna want any kind of flowers, Snoop Dogg need the most potent marijuana dip weed lace flowers in the entire world. Snoop Dogg has stood the test of time. Snoop Dogg is still considered a very, very important, powerful man. Snoop Dogg is gangster, but Snoop Dogg can also be invited to a kindergarten class and, and do coloring time with children. Snoop Dogg will show up to the most suburban area of the entire world, and he will plant flowers with the neighbors, but turn around at 9 o'clock at night, unbutton his shirt with his khaki pants, and he will set it off in the neighborhood. Snoop Dogg is no joke. Snoop Dogg deserves his flowers. We don't give enough credit to Uncle Snoop Dogg. Snoop Dogg can literally call me nephew. I'm a grown ass man. I'm a grown ass man. I'm grown. I got kids. I got bills. I got responsibilities. I will stand up in the paint. Snoop Dogg is probably the only grown man that can put his hand on my head and say, I'm proud of you, nephew. I'm proud of you, nephew. And I might like blush and turn purple and freeze up and say, thank you, Uncle Snoop. Snoop ain't never been my uncle. I don't know nobody in real life that's no Snoop Dogg in real life. But I promise you this. If something ever happened to Snoop Dogg, if somebody tried Snoop Dogg, if Snoop Dogg needed to sleep on my sofa, I will get out my bed and give him my bed and I'll sleep on the sofa. Snoop Dogg still makes it cool to walk around with white socks and house, house shoes. Snoop Dogg. Probably can't bench press 185 pounds, but Snoop Dogg is physically intimidating. His look, his persona, his appearance, Snoop Dogg looked like the nicest, meanest human on the earth, the face of the earth. Snoop, I don't, I'm glad I heard this Justin Bieber song and Snoop Dogg killed the track. The man is still, after 40 years of rapping, 30 years of rapping, 118 million months of rapping, this man still can get on the track and literally say something like, one, two, peaches and cream. Make me think dreams that I never seen, baby boo. I want to come through you and your crew and do what we going to do with the S N O O P D O G. -G. It's the dog pound game. And I'm going to lose my damn mind. And I'm going to be snapping if it's Snoop made me want to listen. I only want to be with you from the baby boy soundtrack. Snoop Dogg should have shot Tyrese in baby boy. Not in real life. I'm just saying the baby boy. He should have won. Snoop Dogg should have survived and had a baby with the chick that Tyrese ain't want to cheat on Yvette with. And then there should have been a baby boy part two where Snoop Dogg's son was getting revenge on Jody son. Oh, my gosh. I think I just wrote a movie. Uncle Snoop, here's your flowers. And may they get you high.